93. This should be 7. 94. Rook e8. 95. Okay. He said keep your eyes open. Oh, I'm in check. I'm in check. And on the 96th move of this game, Martin destroys me with knight to h5 check. I cannot get out of the check by moving this knight, so I just lost. Hey guys, I'm back to challenge Martin, but I'm a copier. I have to copy the exact piece that Martin moved. If Martin moves the epon, I have to move the epon. If Martin moves the knight, I have to move the knight. And if for some reason I don't have that piece to move, I lose. Good luck, Martin. He plays e4, so I will just play e5. Why not? Bishop c4. Okay, let's go bishop c5 and hope he doesn't take my f-pawn or I'll lose. Okay. I guess we'll just play d6. Okay, let's... I mean, I may as well just keep going with it. Uh-oh. So I have to move this knight somewhere. I'm going to have to go for it. I'm going to have to do this idea as well. He plays a3. So the question I have is, how do I actually win? How do I win if I just keep copying? Okay, if we go queen f6 and he takes me, I lose because I don't have a queen to move. So I have to go queen, I guess queen e7 here. h4. Okay, we have h6 and h5 are the options. I feel like I better play h5 to, pr to limit what he's going to do over there. Play c3. I have to play c6. <laughs> All right, Martin, you've given me three interesting choices this looks risky because of the knight coming in not that i think martin would see that this also looks risky this also looks really bad i guess we'll I guess we'll go with king f8 b3 okay i could play b5 here but i won't really be able to take that unless he moves his pawn which ah, i'm gonna do it anyway play b5 he moved his queen. I need to move my queen, so I'm alive. I am still alive. He moved that bishop, so I have to move this bishop. Okay. I guess we'll take this pawn. Yeah, definitely want to take that pawn because I don't have that pawn to move. So yeah, that's important. We'll take that. Oh, Martin. I just lost. Okay, okay. Martin wins with b4. Let's play again. I will resign and rematch. Okay. Oh, I can't be white. Resign, rematch. There we go. Okay, let's try a different strategy. Let's play let's play the French. Knight f3. Let's go for some No, he's probably going to move his bishop. I need to I need to leave that as an option. Let's go here. I was afraid he was going to play this. Okay. So we have to move the d pawn. If I play d5 and he pushes, I lose. If I play d6 and he pushes, I lose as well. I, I guess I have to hope he takes me. Let's let's just hope. Okay, he does this knight, so that's fine. We can still move. Let's go here. Bishop d3. All right, we have to move this bishop. I guess we'll go to b4. He plays a3. If he takes me, I need the option to capture back. So I have to play, I have to play a5. So if I go a6 and he takes, oh, I guess I could still play a5 then. Hmm. Okay, we'll try a6. Because I can still play a5. All right. It's, yeah. So here we go. And g3. Okay, we'll go g6. Rook a2. All right. How do I win? How can I possibly win? I think this is like an impossible challenge. He moves this rook. I'm just going to go back here. Queen e2. Only move. That was close. He moves the knight back. Okay, I can use this opportunity to maybe capture something. Hmm. 
If he takes me, I'll have to move the bishop, or if he takes me, I'll have to move the knight. All right, that's a risk I'm willing to take. He moves the queen. Okay. Let's go... Ooh, if he moves the queen, like, somewhere here, I could actually come in, like, let's go f6. Let's go to f6. All right, Martin. We'll just keep moving our rook. Bishop to b5. I have to move this bishop. Oh, no. He's going to take that. I don't have a choice. But if he takes it, I'm, I lose because I'm in check. Okay. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Did I just move the wrong bishop? I don't have that bishop. What am I... What am I saying? I just lost because I don't have the bishop. Right here. I lose on bishop b5. This is not the same bishop. What am I even saying? Okay, Martin. Let's try again. I'm going to resign. Rematch. Can't be white. Rematch. This is hard. I don't actually know how to win this. Plays d4. Let's play d5 to prevent... Plays here. Okay, let's play e5. Maybe he'll take and I'll, I'll push this forward. He brings that knight out, so I have to bring this knight out. He takes me. I have to move this pawn. He plays knight there. I have to move my knight. Let's go. We'll go here. Plays a3. Okay. a6. e4. I don't have an e4 pawn. Or any e pawn. Let's go again, Martin. I need a new strategy. What can my strategy be? I don't really have a strategy because I'm so limited. Should I play e5 just to mix it up? No, I better not. Okay, well, what if I went? No, if he takes it, I'm 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 lost, so I have to do this. Queen d2. Let's. Yeah, I'll just copy it. A3. Let's go. A6. Four. A5. Okay. I'm never gonna win. I'm never gonna win this. Martin's too good. He's too strong. King H1. <laughs> he plays King H1 like a true, like a true grandmaster. Um, okay. I have to move this knight. The question is, where do I want to move it to? Because if I do this and bait him here, I could take that. That seems pretty risky because he might just take here and then I'm in trouble. Probably in trouble. Let's go. We'll go here, I guess. Okay, moves the rook again. Maybe I'll centralize the rook this time. He takes the queen. I'll take the queen. He takes it. I'll take it. All right. We're looking actually okay. Moves that bishop, so I have to move this bishop. I could take this pawn. Could take this pawn. I'll take the pawn. He moves it again. I can... I could take that too. Okay, Martin. He's giving me a chance. I mean, I still can't actually move my knight because he won't have it, but at least he has lost pieces, so why not? He moves that rook. Okay, let's go here. He moves that rook, and he took my bishop. Oh, that was not smart. Because now I'm going to lose if he moves this. If he if he ever moves this bishop, I just lose. I just lose immediately. So I need to take that at all costs. I need to take this guy at all costs. Okay, knight there. Let's go. Wait, which knight is that? Which, was that his f3 knight? Yes, that was his f3 knight. Which would be this knight. Okay, so I have to move this knight. Um, I want to take the bishop, right? So let yeah, let's... Let's go over here and maybe we can try to take that. Okay, I have to move this rook. 
You gotta be kidding me. I lose. I lose again. Okay, Martin. How can we do this? I'll go work B8. Castle. Bishop B5. Okay, Bishop B4. He goes back. So I don't want to. I don't want to trade like this because that's what I did before, and I got into trouble. I need to keep the bishop alive. So we're gonna go back just like he did. I'm gonna try to keep it as as symmetrical as possible. Okay, draw. Grandmaster, draw here, Martin. Yes, yes. I'm improving after losing so many times. A draw feels like a victory. I feel like I'm on the right track. Come on, Martin. No, I don't want to be white. All right. So, knight to a3. Ooh, should I copy that or should I go for knight c6? I'm going to go knight c6. He goes back. Okay, I mean, I can use this opportunity to put a piece forward. c4, c5, okay. b3, b6, fine. g3, g6. Knight h3. I'll go knight f6. d3. I can put this bishop here, actually. Do I want to do that? Yeah, we'll go here. I gotta, I gotta stop changing it up because when it, whenever I do that, I block my pawn and I can't, I can't do that. Okay. Martin's too smart. He's, he's tricking me. That's what's happening. He's tricking me. Well played, Martin. Well played. I'm onto your tricks, though, and uh, I'm going to make some better choices this game. Let's just go for the, like, direct symmetry. Enough with the uh, getting too clever. You can't overthink it against Martin. You just can't. just can't do it that, that way. All right. I can just copy you all day long, Martin. All day long. Could I have castled? No, that's a king move, I guess, right? I don't want to castle anyway. Come on, Martin. What are you going to do? What are you going to do now? He's going to play king d2. Okay. Two can play that game. All right. I like your setup. I see. <laughs> oh, my. Okay. <laughs> What's he going to do? What is he going to do? He wasn't expecting me to do this. Uh-huh. What else you got? What else you got, Martin? e3, e6, h3, h6. Okay, so we switched our king and our queen. Our queen. All right, we're going to do it again. Nope, now we're going to bring the rook over. Okay. We're going to come back here. All right. All right, that's right. Let's re reposition our pieces. <laughs> nice bishop that we have here. Well played, Martin. Okay. I'm just leaving it to Martin to uh, dictate how this game is going to go. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. See what you did there with the rook. I see that. Yeah, so let's keep maneuvering our king. Oh, going on the offensive, is he? All right. I could do this all day, Martin. I could do this all day. Uh-oh. That's a scary move. That's a scary move. Let's go back here. Okay, let's come over. 
Martin likes to use his king as a weapon. I've I've noticed that. Bishop back to b7, okay. Whatever you say, Martin. Whatever you say. Okay. <laughs> okay, we finally traded something. All right. I wonder how long this game will go if we just keep doing that. Like, I wonder if Martin's just going to keep doing this. I guess eventually we'll hit the 50. Oh, I messed up. Can I take back? I have to take back. I didn't, I didn't mean to do that. That was... My brain just died. Well, I guess technically I'm allowed to do that. But I didn't want to do that. If I lose the game because he plays bishop e2, I'm going to I'm going to be upset at myself. Let's we'll just keep going. I'm going to be very upset if he plays bishop b2 right now. Or at any point in the future, I'm going to be upset. And it goes here. Come on, move your queen, Martin. Okay. Well, that's interesting. Uh <laughs> This is awkward. This is awkward. Well, where is he most likely to move his queen to? One of these four squares? So I'll just go here. Or uh, we'll go here. So that I can go to wherever he moves the queen to next time. Okay. We, we might be back back to a completely symmetrical game. A little bit of a hiccup there, but um, I think we're okay. Because he can't move the bishop, so I should be fine. Are we going to get another draw? No. Martin doesn't want to draw. All right. There we go. We are back. We are back to completely symmetrical. All right. That was that was scary. Okay. Swing the rook over here. Oh no, he's gonna take this. Oh Martin, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't. Oh, nice. Good move, Martin. Oh, he keeps me alive. I'm still in this. I'm still in this. Seventy-two moves. Can I just say that if I make it to 100 moves, I win? Is that is that a fair way to, to change the rules here a little bit? If I make it to 100 moves, I win? I think that's fair. I should get a win if I make it to 100 moves. We're at 75 right now. 25 moves is still a lot of moves to make. Queen A2, okay. Knight comes back. It comes back. I apologize if you hear a screaming baby. We have a three-month-old. Queen to b7. We're at 81 moves. Queen to c7. Queen. <laughs> what is Martin doing? Okay. 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 86 moves. Come on. Let's go. Ooh. That's... If he would have taken that rook, it, actually, if he takes that rook at any point, it's over. 90 moves. Come on. 10 more moves. Come on, Martin. Don't take any pieces. Don't trade. You don't want to trade right here. 93. This should be 7. 94. Rook e8. 95. Okay. He said, keep your eyes open. Oh, I'm in check. I'm in check. And on the 96th move of this game, Martin destroys me with knight to h5 check. I cannot get out of the check by moving this knight. So I just lost. 96 moves. I'm going to try one more time and see if I can make it to 100 moves. If I do, that's going to count as a win. If not, I'm going to give up and say Martin is too strong. He's just too strong. Ooh, G4. All right, double grob variation. And this has no name. And he takes it. Okay, let's go. Let's go, Martin. Come on. What have you got? C6. Okay. That's kind of scary. Okay. I wonder if there's a way I could checkmate him if he if he like moves the queen at the wrong moment. Ooh. 
so should I go for the copycat completely or should I keep the queen on this diagonal? This is actually a critical moment in the game. I really think this is a critical moment in the game because th this is, I mean, this is a possibility. He moves the pawn and then he moves the queen. Oh, it's not going to, it's not even going to be checkmate though because if he moves the queen so that I can move my queen, then he has a place to run. So I better just go back. Okay. Okay. What a sneaky move. I, I can't castle. You can't castle through check. I didn't think Martin was capable of such clever tricks. Okay, that, that was too short. We got to try once more. We got to try again. I mean... All right, come on, Martin. This is it. We're going for 100 moves. I, I'm feeling feeling good about this game. Yes. Just nice and quiet opening. Ooh. A little bit more aggressive than I was hoping for, but we can work with this. All right. Queen c7. Mm hmm. All right. Let's bring that knight out. Wow. Queen trade? Nope. Okay. Okay. Queen over to b2. Interesting. f3, f6. Okay. This looks like a relatively safe position. Looks like I have options with whatever Martin does. Yep, that seems fine. Okay, we'll bring the rook over. We're on move 18. Still have a ways to go. Rook to d8. Queen a6. We'll bring the knight back. Should e7, all right. Uh oh, I don't like to see those kind of moves. He takes that one. I have to take this way. This is risky. This is really. That's okay, actually. It's okay. Oh my, I'm 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 I don't have a good feeling about this. I don't have a good feeling about this. He takes? Oh no. There's two. Because any of these captures, just I lose. So that's what I'm I'm worried about. Martin. He's going to... Oh, he didn't take it. He didn't take it. He's not taking it. He's not taking my rook. Okay. We are still alive. We are still alive. I mean... I guess I can actually start deviating if I wanted to. Like, I could move this bishop somewhere else. No, I better not. That's too risky. But let's just go here. All right. Just let's stick with the plan. We'll go for the 100 move rule. All right. We're going to take this. Go here. Okay. This is good. This is looking pretty good. Hmm. Yeah. I mean, I feel like the more pieces we trade, the better my chances are. I don't want to take that because then, then I won't have the knight. Yeah, I, I got to just keep doing this. Okay. Let's just stick with it. We're at move 48. Um. Oh, did I make him? I moved the wrong rook. I'm going to cheat. I'm, I'm just going to cheat. I'm sorry, guys. I'm going to go back. Can I take back? Does it let me take back? He moves here. Where's the take back button? Is it not? Can I not take back? Did, did I do challenge? There's no take backs in challenge? Martin. He tricked me. I, I just, I saw the rook and I just, you know... All right, Martin. You win. You win. You win. He's too good. I mean, he's too strong. Martin's too strong at this copycat variation. 25 blunders. I had 25 blunders. <laughs> 10 missed wins, 25 blunders, and 11 mistakes.
All right, well, if you guys have ideas for the next Martin video, let me know. This one was quite challenging, more difficult than I, than I realized actually. So anyway, uh, I'll see you guys next time. Stay sharp, play smart, take care.